There she is. Uh. Diaz, you did it. They found him guilty on all charges. Huh. Boyle's advice worked. <laughs> so, where is your happy place? I'm in a cabin in the middle of nowhere. Inside, it's just me and that stupid, slimy defense attorney. And I'm eating the hell out of him. I break a dining room table over his head. Then I rip off his arm and shove it where the sun don't shine. Then I reach down his throat and shake his hand. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and schedule you for a psyche valve. I owe you one, Boyle. Thank you, dinner. Tomorrow night. Rivaldi's. It's all you can eat, Linguini. Yes! Oh, my boyfriend's coming too. Your what right now? Everything okay with Diaz? Yeah, she fell asleep five minutes after I locked her in, and she hasn't moved in the past ten hours. She talks in her sleep. I'm gonna rip your head off. I'm gonna rip your damn head off, Grandma. Oh, Terror Bear, what if she sleeps forever? <laughs> oh, oh, You look great, girl. I gotta get out of here. Bye. You better not run because I will catch you after I'm done crushing that perp you are next. I already interrogated the perp for you. You what? I got him to name his Giggle Pig supplier. It's all good. Now go home and get better. I could have done it myself. No, you couldn't have. You literally have been in a coma since yesterday. Now, I know you like to act like you don't need any help, but we all do. Look, I asked five dudes to spot me when I'm doing my squats. Terry paid me $20 to lock you up. No, I did not. But I took that cheddar and I made you this special. Rose is gonna make this called her bitch care package. Now's the time where you say thank you for all your help. Thank you for all your help. Wait, is that a smile I see? Possibly. My immune system is too weak to fight off my small muscles. Maybe put Hitchcock's head on top like an angel. Mm, like that? No, put it behind the tree. Thanks for helping me make this card. You're so good at this stuff. I know, I'm good at everything. All right, so here's all the pictures of Rosa that we have. Which one should we use? Ugh, she never smiles. Is her mouth broken? Well, what about if we flip those lips? Oh, Ooh. God. That's horrifying. We have to get a picture of Rosa smiling. Holt's card has to be perfect. Guys, I got this. I can make Rosa smile. Just keep your cameras ready. Making coffee? Can you make another cup for Senor Tickle and his nueve amigos? Tickle, tickle! What the hell, Hitchcock? No! Ow, 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 ow. I, I think you sprained Senor Tickle. Next time, I break it off. <laughs> Oh, you know, everyone should just go home and enjoy their Christmas. You don't need to stick around here for me. Shut up. No one's going anywhere. What you did was amazing. Yeah, Boyle, that was some Superman stuff. Yeah, you did the 9-9 nine -nine proud. No ifs, ands, or buts. Sorry, it's just right there. Literally, it's just right in front of me. His butt is right in my face. I have to tell you guys something. Even though I got shot. In the butt. Sorry. I'd rather be here spending Christmas with all of you than on some stupid singles cruise. I mean that, from the bottom of my... But, again, sorry. Ow! Shut up, Jake. Will's a hero. And so is his butt. I got it, she smiled. Christmas card complete. He got shot in the butt. Hey, so I checked again. Doug Judy still hasn't surfaced. Yeah, he has. He just sent me this. What's up, Peralta? Greetings from paradise. Actually, I'm a little disappointed in the hotel. How you mess up an omelet? It's just a flat egg. He pretty much just talks about the omelet for the next 10 minutes, but... About my escape. This is my associate, Kyle. He drove the garbage truck. You may also remember him as the room service waiter I had you tip so generously. Son of a bitch. Yeah, and when he ordered the lobster, it was code for Kyle to follow him. Anyway, tell Dia she loves me. Merry Christmas! Hey, first things first, I swear to you we are gonna catch Doug Judy. Yeah, I know. We did it once, we can do it again. No, we will catch him. More importantly, thank you. I know how hard that was to make that choice and let him get away. No, it was an easy call. 
I know how much this task force means to you. He means so much and it's been so stressful and it went so well. Seriously, look at me, I cannot stop smiling. How do people do this with their faces? Hey there, beautiful. Marcus, what are you doing here? Well, I know you lost your phone charger, so I got you a new one. Yeah, I want to make sure your phone's all juiced up for some sweet long distance texting. Thanks. What do I owe you? It's a gift. All you got to say is thank you. I said thank you. That was the first thing I said. Sorry. You're nice. I'll text you. Can't wait. Inappropriate work, kids. Too fast. Can't stop me. Rosa D knocking down with her boo on the street. I love it. Say boo again, I will shoot you in the stomach. Fine. Love a boy it is. What did I just say, you Charles? Said, what did I just you say? You said not to say it. Marcus, Detective Diaz, what a surprise. I didn't expect you for another nine and a half minutes. See, told you it was rude to be early. Well, let's cancel the entire evening and try again next year. <laughs> <laughs> she is hilarious. I thought you might need some help setting up. Oh, I'll help with these and some water. Thank you. Marcus, you can help with the buff bourguignon. I sub shallots for onions in the mirepoix. No, are you kidding? I have no idea. Okay, before we go in, remember, you have to pretend to be surprised. How's this? Oh my God, it's so much worse than I imagined. The energy was great, but the message was flawed. All right, let's get this over with. Surprise. What's going on? I rented this entire bar so you and I could celebrate with no people anywhere near us. Probably should have hired a bartender, though. I have no idea how to make drinks. This is incredible. This is all Charles's idea. I told you I knew you, Roro. Thank you. <laughs> but never call me Roro again. Oh, but I will. I've earned this. Happy B Day, Roro! Woo! Okay. So, I'm going to face my fear of confined spaces. When I'm ready, you will shut the trunk and leave me here for 30 minutes. I left a juice box and a diaper in there for you, so you're gonna be fine. Or we could all give in to our fears and keep our blood in our bodies like normal people. No, Rosa, we are doing something important here. We are women standing up and supporting each other and becoming. New fear, listening to Amy inspire us. Be back in a half hour, Ames. Wait! Come back! Come back, I can't do this! No, you're the best! <laughs> you did it. How'd it go? Well, the first 10 minutes were really terrible. The diaper did not fit. It was for a baby. But then I relaxed and I found my inner strength. I think the lesson here is that as women, we- No, 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 You close that trunk again and I will kill you! You hear me? I will kill you! Isabel Cortez, welcome to your new home. This is gonna be fun. Really? What are your weekends like, Diaz? All right. It's time, detective. Don't forget you're seven months pregnant. Your cervix is ripening as we speak. Mention my cervix again and I will rip your throat out. I don't understand. You don't like it when he talks about your cervix ripening? Okay, have fun. Oh my God, Rosa, I accidentally opened your mail, but look what it says. Dear Miss Diaz, you just won. Rosa, guess what? I accidentally opened your mail, and here's what it says. Dear Miss Diaz, you just won. No, I'm reading the letter, and you're taking the picture. Ha! You're trying to get me to smile for your dumb picture, but you messed up. Ah, she smiled! She smiled! And no one has a camera. Got it, Amy. Got a picture of you frowning. That's what you wanted, right? Here she comes. Big smiles. Hey, Rosa. Hey, how's my bike? Great. It actually was a lot of fun to ride. Once I got the hang of it. And you were able to finish everything on my list? Wasn't too much, was it? No. Not at all. If anything, you didn't ask enough of us. Great, because I thought of a few more things. Oh, were you able to send that email to Adrian? Oh, yes, he wrote back right away. It wasn't as graphic as I feared. He wrote, the number eight, equal sign, 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 capital D. Oh, I see what this is. This is a- Yep, 